I really don't know why I'm letting you know my YouTube secrets out to my supporters. I guess it's because I'm beginning, you know, to to grow love for you guys. I'm beginning to like, you know, become a very best of myself to you. I am beginning to be real. Like, I really don't want to fake it anymore. And it hurts me seeing my students struggling to get views or struggling to come up with a good title, struggling to come up with a good description, struggling to come up with a good word. Um, keywords and tags whenever they are creating their video and because of that guys I've decided to let out all the secret apps and websites that I've been using to generate all my videos yes when I mean all my videos starting from getting my tag getting my title getting my description getting my thumbnails and uploading my video on youtube so please if today is your first time coming to this channel on this channel guys i teach about tips to create what a very profitable african folktale stories and at times youtube tips do you understand so if today is your first time do it to like this video share this video drop your comment and please subscribe and turn on your notification sign reason you are turning on your notification sign is to always get notified whenever what i personally drop a new video on my youtube channel so guys to cut it short in today's video guys i'm going to review to you guys all the tools including the website and apps that i've been using for the past four years on youtube that has been working for you and definitely if you should use the same thing you will monetize your channel and you will start making money on youtube so please if this video is something you will love to learn or you will love to know the ingredients that i've been using sit with me from very start to the end of this video and do not forget that the last one app and the website i'll be mentioning is actually the best of all and if you should learn how to use this particular website and app very well automatically you will see your videos skyrocketing with a lot of views engagement and traffic coming into your channel so guys without further ado let's dive into the full tutorial video first up on my list is what Y tag pro so this is the Y tag pro guys watch let me use my arrow sign to show you Y tag pro so this is Y tag pro guys can you see so now what is the work of this white tag pro what this white tag pro does is this you can actually use this white white tag pro to copy title on youtube like a trending video on youtube all you need to do is just to go to your youtube then you copy the link of that particular video like you want to mimic or you want to use the keywords the tags and the title do you understand so once you copy the video link let me show you guys how to do that because as i'm saying it let me be doing it so let me just go to youtube so once i open the youtube now let's assume that since i'm talking about folktale stories so let me come here and search for folktale so so this is folktale stories so once i search for folktale stories as you can see four days ago this video has fetched 100 and 2k views that's 100,000 100,000 k views plus so this is what i want to do if i want to copy that particular link of this video now so this is what i have to do so i have to click here do you see where the arrow is pointing at good so once you click on that three dots just click on the three dot now you see this you click on this part that says what share so once you click on this share can you see so once you click on this share you have the link so click on copy link now i have copied the link so after you've copied the link this is the next thing you need to do just come back open your white tag this is my white tag bro. sorry so let me open my white tag pro this is my white tag pro so once you open your white tag pro this is how your white tag pro will look like then from there so as you can see my white tag pro is opening let's exercise patient guys so now it has opened so once your white tag pro open this is what you need to do you click on this button here look at this button here the link button the bold one is it pink or ox blood with color so once you click on it now these are the varieties of actions that this white tag pro can actually do you can use it to copy tags can you see you can use it to copy tags you can use it to copy title you can use it to download thumbnail you can use it to copy what description then coming down here you can still use the channel you can download the channel logo then you can see information about this particular channel do you understand like this partner is very very important for people that is actually starting up on youtube should in case you have zero mind on how to get profitable keywords and tags you can actually still 
keywords and tag from what for a from a viral african folktale channel do you understand so all you need to do is just once you click you paste that particular link that you've copied from youtube do you understand so once you copy you click on search so once you click on search automatically you'll be seeing information consigning that particular channel do you understand what i'm saying so that's what is loading here so let's exercise patient guys and network is really really kind of slow these days so let's exercise patient so let's check that again good so as you can see once you click it will open like this then as you can see this is the description of the channel like once you visit the channel if you want to know what the channel is all about this is the description of the channel you can easily come here copy the description of this channel then rephrase the words so you don't copy exactly what this person is actually doing that is one then after that now coming down now you will see that total views is this this is that then this is the channel category personal and vlogs can you see into bucket 22 then after that so now after you've gotten this come back now let's assume that you are working with a particular video and you want to get the title of that video so all you have to do is just to close this then come to this part that says title so once you click on title you click on the share button can you see the title of this story now has pop up then some keywords some tags that the person is using is it so i have got to now that is that about why tag pro you can use it to copy title you can use it to check thumbnails you can use it to download thumbnails you can use it to you know to download or to copy tags if the person is actually using tags on his or her video then the second app on my list is what pixel app then pixel app is actually is an android app yes i don't know if ios has their own but mainly it's an android app and what i normally use this pixel app to do is to copy what is to copy my is to design my thumbnails and now this is the pixel app app once you go to to chrome to play store just search for pixel app can you see that is the app on my android smartphone so what i have to do is just to click on it then to prove to you guys that this is the app that i've been using uh, can you see so this is the app i've been using to design my thumbnail and this is youtube thumbnail size and one thing most about this app is that you can actually you can use this app to you can use this app to design anything you can even use it to design banner yes flex banner barrier banner you can use it to design book cover you can use it to design anything you want to design once you know the size just inside the size and you are go with it but let me prove to you guys that this has been the app that i'm using to design my thumbnail so once you open your your pixel app this is the normal size this is the default size it will show you so once you come to this part you click here choose in case you want to use it just click on this three icon above here so once you click on the three icon above here then you will see this option that says what image size can you see just click on the image size then once you click on the image size you have this click on this small rectangle or triangle that small one just click on it then once you click on it so you have different sizes you have your costume which you are the one to insert the size you want you have your square you have your profile picture you have your channel the youtube channel banner this is the one i do use at times if i want to design my youtube channel banner then this is youtube thumbnail so once you select your youtube thumbnail you click on the ok can you see this is the perfect size for youtube thumbnail then once you have this now you start your design in here do you understand but to prove to you guys that this is what i've been using so i have to go to my project so let me just click on my project this is my project here where the arrow is facing now as you can see these are many thumbnails that you've been seeing on my youtube channel this was the one i used last can you see then if i should still go back again this is was the one i used again can you see and as you can see everything is raw can you see can, i can move it i can remove i can add then coming back again there is still this one look at this one this is another one can you see so this is just to prove to you guys that this has this is the app that i've been using to generate or to create my thumbnails then the third app on my list is what is tag rapid tags good now the work of this rapid tag is this it helps you to get keywords you know profitable keywords for your videos and now this one is that is not actually a, um, an application it is a website which means that everybody can actually have access to this website now so this is what you need to do guys so here now open your chrome browser so once you open your chrome browser to come here and search for 
rapid parts. Just forget what this stuff is doing. So once you come here, you search for what rapid tags rapid. So you have to search for rapid. Can you see? So this is the correct word you're searching for. You're searching for this rapid tags. Can you see? Good. So once you click on this rapid tags, you click on the first link showing here on your search engine. So click on the first link showing on your search engine. This is the link. So once you click on the link showing on your search engine, this is how the rapid tag looks like. You really don't need to, you know, you don't need to create an account. You don't need to log in. So once you come here, you click on what use key tags. Can you see who use tag generator? That's what you will click. You click on this button that says use tag generator. Are you seeing it? Good. So once you click on it now, now this will appear like this then this part that says enter your next youtube video title are you seeing it enter your next youtube video title here this is where i'm talking about can you see it said enter your new youtube video title so this is where you'll be putting in the title of the video that you want to upload on your channel so let me just click on it now and let's assume that i want to that i'm creating video about how to how to generate African photo images. This is that. So once you type for this, you click on this search icon button by the side. This is where you need to click after you've clicked, like after you've entered your key, your title of your video, you click there to get your this thing. It seems to be taking a while to generate your tag. Sorry for the delay. It is okay. I guess this is because of network though. Network is really bad. But finally we've been able to get to you know to generate our keywords. Can you see our keywords and tag? Now see African folk tales, African folk tales in English. Can you see all these stuff now is what you can actually use. So after you've gotten this all you need to do is just to click on agree. Then you copy. Can you see? So once you copy this now let me show you guys that yes it works. So let me go to my YT tag. Let's assume that I want to add those keywords here. So what I need to do is just to click on my edit button here. Then click here. Sorry. Then click here. This is where I have to add it if I want to add it. Can you see? So coming to this part now, this is what I need to do. Just come here. Give more space. Then you click. Can you see all the stuff that I've copied is what you are seeing here. The stuff that I copy from that particular website is what you are seeing here. Then after you've done this, just come back and click on save. Can you see it has saved and automatically I've used that without stressing myself. And guys, it works. Do not like let that part. Then now the fourth one is Microsoft Designer. The work of this Microsoft Designer is mainly for um, is mainly for folktale channels. You can actually use it to generate what your images. Do you understand for your story? Now, this is proof of it. All these images you are seeing on my phone, I design them or I generate them using what? My Microsoft Designer. All these images you are seeing now, I was able to get them using what? My Microsoft Designer. As you can see, all these things are images for stories. Do you understand? And you too can equally do that. So all you need to do is just to go to your Microsoft Designer create an account with Microsoft Designer and start using it. Do not forget that the best images you can actually get depends on how good you are at what, at structuring your prompts for your images. Do you understand? So it's very, very important. Then after that, the next website you need is what your chat GPT. I strongly, I strongly believe that chat GPT is very popular to everyone now and everyone knows how to use chat GPT and what ChatGPT does. Do you understand? Good. So in case if you don't know, ChatGPT is the main key key. It's the main key. You can use ChatGPT to generate your video description for your YouTube. You can use ChatGPT to generate, you know, clickable through it and clickable titles for your for your videos on YouTube. You can equally use ChatGPT to do what? To generate you know your your script for your story so literally you can use ChatGPT to do everything and now say you can even use ChatGPT to generate images for your folktale story so it depends on the version of ChatGPT that you're actually using so that's what to do most about ChatGPT. then the next website or app you can actually use is what is your clip shop 
yes your clip sharp is what that helps you to convert your script to human like voice and please be mindful of this this clip sharp is not actually meant for folk tale story generators alone so, um, clip sharp can actually be used by faceless youtube channels if you don't want your voice to be heard you can use clip sharp to convert all your video script to what to ai voice do you understand so that's just that for you and that's what clip sharp mainly is used for you can use it to edit video too but i have not used it but mainly what i use it for is you know for converting my script to human like voice and the reason i do um and the reason i do recommend clip sharp to all my students or all my supporters or why i do mention most clip sharp is because it has varieties of languages that you can use you can see english you can you see english english nigeria you can see english britain you can see english united you can see you know different varieties and what those stuff usually does is this once you select english nigeria the accent will be in nigeria and if you select english british the accent too will be different do you understand so that is the work of that for you then now the most key is this the next app you can use is what your cap cut cap cut is mainly for what for editing your videos yes CapCut is the best because it has all the features you can actually imagine of. You can use CapCut to blur your background. You can use CapCut. In fact, you can use CapCut to do literally everything you can actually think of. Yes, you can use CapCut to do everything that you can actually think of. CapCut is just the best, guys. CapCut is the best. You can use CapCut to add your auto capture. You can use CapCut to blur your background. You can use CapCut to edit yourself add smoothness increase your color your skin tone and all that guy you can even use CapCut to reduce sound you can use CapCut to increase your voice that is the volume of your speaking is literally everything you can use CapCut to change your the sound of your video so literally you can do anything with CapCut then now guys the final app you can actually use as a youtuber or as a folktale story generator is what is your yt studio and this is the yt studio a lot of students neglect this what a lot of students does is they will just come upload video and start using youtube to track their videos if you're using youtube to track the analysis of your video automatically you will not get the right through result for your video or where your views are coming from so yt studio is the best and once you click on yt studio this is how your yt studio will look like so as you can see here literally you are seeing everything do you understand you are seeing everything you are seeing your views you are seeing your watch hour you are seeing your subscribers then you are seeing your estimated revenue this is not actually the actual money i've made this month do you understand this is just the preamble or the expectations like the ranging revenue of my channel then after that you can see the titles and everything you are getting is here can you see so that is that for you and coming here now guys coming to your content so once you click on your content this is how it will look like then just click on view all your long form videos now this is it and if you should click on any particular video here automatically you'll be seeing your track record of that particular video so that is just that guys and that is just that so please i am begging you if this video helps you do where to like share this video drop your comments subscribe and turn on your notification sign so guys these are actually the website and apps that i've been using it is working perfectly for me and if you should learn how to use them automatically it will work for you and please let me know in the comment section if you want me to do a few tutorial course on how you can use any of this application or websites that i've mentioned thank you and please guys stay tuned guys bye
like share this video drop your comments subscribe and turn on your notification sign so guys these are actually the website and apps that i've been using it is working perfectly for me and if you should learn how to use them automatically it will work for you and please let me know in the comment section if you want me to do a few tutorial course on how you can use any of these applications or websites that i've mentioned thank you and please guys stay tuned guys bye